A disturbing trend, more dead whales are washing up on the shores of the West Coast, specifically in Washington. Another gray whale was found dead, which marks five reported strandings just this month. Fox 12's Bonnie Silkman has more on what wildlife experts are saying about this. Two more gray whales recently washed up in Washington, both of them emaciated. So that makes a total of five reported dead whales in the state in just a month. To give you an idea, Washington usually sees about five dead whales in a year. So that's part of why wildlife experts are calling this an unusual mortality event. The unusual rise in dead gray whales on the West Coast has been under the microscope for years now. Take a look at this map. Those red markings indicate a reported death of a gray whale. At least 100 strandings were reported every year dating back to 2019 from Mexico through Alaska. So far this year, there have been 63. That map is from the National Oceanic and Atmospheric Administration, or NOAA. And one of the recent discoveries in Washington was a female gray whale found floating near Olympia. Biologists say it had poor blubber condition and a lack of fat. Then, not long after, a male gray whale was discovered near ocean shores with the same emaciated traits. The Cascadia Research Collective often performs necropsies on dead whales in Washington. They take measurements and samples to better understand the whale's condition. They say preliminary information shows that many whales have been found emaciated at the time of their deaths. Though that finding is not consistent across all whales, so more research, they say, needs to be done. Unfortunately, it's not a simple picture. Part of the reason for the concern is this unusual mortality event has gone on longer than the previous one. These latest mortalities, I think, still leave us guessing uh, what it means. And there was a growing hope that the unusual mortality event was nearing its end, but this month's increase in deaths could change that. The eastern North Pacific population of gray whales had been a success story. Decades of commercial whaling decimated that population, pushing them to the brink of extinction. But after rebounding to a new high point, the population has now dropped by nearly 40 percent over the past seven years. Experts say because the numbers rebounded, the larger population could be running into a lack of prey. And wildlife experts also say that climate change could be changing their feeding grounds. NOAA has created an independent team of scientists to research this trend and take samples from the whales. Their goal is to determine if any recent changes in the ocean's ecosystem are playing a role in this. For now, reporting in studio, Bonnie Silkman, Fox 12 Oregon.